I'd now like to show you how to create a drilling tool path. This is quite basic really. Here I have a bunch of circles that I have created. I'll go into tool paths and select the create drilling tool path. I'll just tap that over to here. here you can see I have selected vectors so I would need to go around selecting every vector. I could drag a box around those but it's a little bit of a pain. So what I have done I have installed a vector pack. So if I just come back to my project and open up the vector layers here you can see I have two layers one that says 3mm and one that's 6mm. These are the layers that the actual circles are on. So if I select to just show the 6mm, there we have the 6mm. If I select to show the 3mm, there are the 3mm holes. So I'll just switch everything back on and go back onto my drilling tool path. Instead of selected vectors, I'm going to choose the 3mm layer. The finished depth is let's say 5mm, the material I'll set that up as 5mm and OK that just zoom back in, the tool I'm going to use a 3mm M and click calculate now there you can see it's created a tool path for everything that's on that particular layer so I'll just close this and I'm going to create another tool path and this time select the 6mm layer the tool is going to be 6mm as well and then click calculate now. There you can see it's created a drilling tool path on the 6mm as well. I'll just close this dialog box and then simulate the tool paths and there you can see it's created two drilling tool paths for me which is made a lot easier by having the vector pack installed.